Hey guys, welcome to interview questions and answers tutorials. I'm Ripon Dotto. This is fifth class. Today I'm gonna discuss about how to reverse a linked list using recursion. So let's get started. All right, this is our singly linked list. So first of all, we need to take the first node, which is one. So this is our first node one and we need to change the pointer let's say one will point to null so one will point to null all right then we need to pick up two then so two should be come here should come here and two i mean next of two should be one so next of two is one similarly we have to pick up now three which will be here and next of three should be two so this is three and finally we need to pick up the four so next of four should be three in this way we can reverse our linked list and when our linked list reaches at the null on the time our linked list traversing is finished that means this is our um, base case for recursion now let's get us started with visual studio so first take a project in this case i'm gonna use console application give the application name reverse link list using recursion all right so first we need to make class which is node so public node next private integer let's say value so next in the constructor next equal null and value equal zero in the overrated constructor next equal null this dot value equal value so in this case this dot value means this is the instance variable which is this one and equal value which is parameter uh, argument all right now we need to write a getter method let's say value return value that's it now we need to create our linked list let's we have head which is root let's say this is one so root equal root dot next i mean next value should be another node which is two similarly three and four so this is three and this is four now i need to 
at a print method head so it will print head the next while current not equal null we need to print current oops, the value then current equal current dot next all right now we can run it control f5 oh i see head dot next because head is now the value one so what we need to do is just root is uh, empty then we need to I mean head point to the root which is initially empty then we create the root equal 1 then serial 2 3 4 now let's see yep 1 2 3 4 now we need to head equal reverse list will send the head so all right in this case I want to make this not current and I want to add another parameter which is previous so this should be next and second parameter is initially null all right so if oops, current equal null then it will return null if current the next equal null then it will return so current dot next equal previous then return current In this case we can also say current all right now we need to change first we need to get the new node let's say new node equal current dot next then current dot next equal previous we are just changing the pointer let's say this one this is our new node so this current dot next equal previous one previous is 3 all right then we need to call the recursive call again with new node and current node should be previous all right so this is our recursive process so first of all current node is one and previous is initially null so it will come to here node new node equal current dot next which is two this one then current dot next current node is basically one so current dot next equal previous initially previous was null that's why you can see one dot next equal null and current dot next equal previous which I already told you then return the re then return I mean call the recursive call again with new node and current so current is now 1 and new node is 2 so when it will come here again in the next aspect frame current node equal 2 and previous equal 1 
so it will come here again new node equal current dot next that means two dot next which is three and current dot next equal previous that means current is now two two dot next equal previous previous is one now you can see two dot next equal previous which is one and we need to call the node again so this is the way how to uh, reverse the linked list in I mean using recursion now we need to print the list again so in this case we are returning the list only not we are just returning the list not head so in this case we need to take this list into head dot next so head dot next equal this list so now we can run control f5 you can see 1 2 3 4 then again 4 3 2 1 or you can oops print a line reverse yep 1 2 3 4 4 3 2 1 so thank you very much for watching this tutorial if you like this tutorial don't forget to subscribe this channel and you have any question you can make a comment in the comment box so see you soon in the next tutorial till then bye